Hello everyone and welcome back to the Keep Productive YouTube channel. Today's feature, we'll be diving into the top seven all-round project management applications. We will be outlining some of the ones that work in a lot of use cases. These aren't gonna be specialist applications, so they'll have some of the general features you'd expect in a project management application. We plan to do some specialist features in the coming videos to hopefully share what sort of specific features matter to you. So if you're new here, please do subscribe. It'd be great to have you. We do plenty of features like this, so please do hit the subscription button. So number one, we have ClickUp. Now this is an application that has been around for a little bit of time now, but has grown pretty rapidly, adding features at a fairly rapid rate as well allowing you to do a range of different views in the application. Now what's nice as well is it does have a free plan, so you're not committed to a trial, so you can start the solo plan or the, for example, the free plan and pretty much get started with stuff, you get unlimited tasks and projects, but then when you want to sort of go a bit further in terms of your storage limits, the change of views, then you can upgrade there. But this application is a great all-rounder and they also take note of what features need to improve when you submit them in the community. So in terms of all round abilities, it does a great job, especially in the viewing options. You've got Gantt, you've got Chart, you've got Box and a range more. Now number two is Monday.com. Chances are you've probably heard of it because of an advert popping up. They are very aggressive on the old adverts, but they do make a very good all round application. Now, monday.com provides you with a, a range of views. And what I like about it as well is it's very customizable in terms of how you can set things up. They've also got a range of templates. So if you were, for example, to quickly move from another application like Excel, or you were doing it in a sort of more old school application, um, and you wanted to move something more modern as a team, this application has templates to get you started and going on that from marketing to sales, which is pretty good. So that's something that monday.com does do well in. So number three is Rike. And this is an application that does get a credit, but it's sort of like a bit of a hidden gem of the all rounders. It is an application that does pretty much everything well. It's much more tailored towards marketers and those in sales. Uh, I'm not sure why, but I think it might be to do with the document abilities in the application. And it's got a general sort of design that seems to be pretty popular with just everyone. For example, applications like Monday or even Basecamp might be specifically popular to different areas or industries, but naturally, Rike has probably the most all-round design out of all of them. They also have a range of apps and integrations, much like ClickUp and Monday.com, but they allow you to connect with applications like Adobe Creative Cloud, GitHub and Jira, and many more. Now, number four on the list is Asana. Now, this has been around for a long time and it actually was created by one of the Facebook founders and it definitely has a good insight how the world of work works. <laughs> So Asana allows you to create these lovely boards and also in the pro account allows you to create these timelines. And it is a great little hub for you and your team to work on stuff, for commenting, to be able to share and insert stuff through email. It's got a range of abilities and you can connect with plenty of applications. Most recently you can connect with Zoom to share your workspace with your team members in real time that works with the new Zoom Zaps feature. So Asana is pretty much a staple of the market and it's definitely a great all-round application. So number five is Basecamp. This is a great application if you're in the creative industry or designer or you want to work more asynchronously. This means that you don't necessarily want to work in real time. You might have a lot of people in different time zones that need to be communicated or kept updated regularly, but asynchronously instead of in real time. Now Basecamp has some great features like for example, a messages board and also the ability to plan and schedule ahead with different people's calendars. You can also plan projects and invite clients to different areas to help you to keep organized on information, logos, files, and documents. And it was also designed by a team that keeps mindfulness at the heart of their product. Number six, and this is actually a little bit of a tricky one to be to share because I actually think Notion is now such a great project management tool 
especially for those who are looking for a wiki as well. If, for example, you can get wiki tools inside of ClickUp where you can use docs. However, Notion has that as their sort of primary feature, but it also has a ton of databases that allows you to keep everything organized through managing them in different views like board, gallery, table, and timeline now. And there's loads more as well, but this is a very impressive application if you're looking for things to be static, but also things to be in motion like with your application. So I definitely recommend checking out Notion as a project manager these days. Number seven is Trello. Now, obviously we know Trello as the great board application. It's been around for a while, despite being purchased by Atlassian a few years ago. But Atlassian has actually pushed to make it a lot better. They've pulled more features out of it than ever. But Trello has some really beautiful features. More importantly, it's adding views in the future. So you won't be stuck with just the boards view. And also they're working and putting a lot of time and attention into something called Butler Automations, which allows you to connect to other services, but also most importantly, automate specific actions inside of your Trello account. So once you and your team enter the page, if you've got Butler Automation set up, you can make these custom actions roll. So for example, you can nudge certain people when certain things are done automatically, or you can do certain actions where you move cards to different places and so much more. It's a great experience for that. As you can imagine, there's tons of them on the market, so we'll be covering more specific ones in the near future, but it'd be great to have you here in the community, so please do make sure you subscribe. Anyway, folks, Hope you enjoy and find one. Let me know what you go with in the comments below. And I'll talk to you all very soon. Cheerio.